Cameo appearance in Nudist Colony of the Dead is unfortunately yet to be released. He invented the term sci-fi, was a friend and confidant of all the major science fiction writers and horror movie actors. Forrest Ackerman is Mr. Science Fiction, a publisher, writer and owner of the world's largest collections of horror and science fiction memorabilia. He's here with some of his collection for the Science Fiction Conference in Wellington this weekend. Mark Sainsbury went to check out Forrest Ackerman and his Chamber of Horrors. Excuse me, I'm looking for Mr. Ackerman. Good morning, sir. Allow me. Thank you. cameos in films like The Howling or the cult classic The Kentucky Fried Movie. Coupled with his writing and collecting, the man who invented Vampirella is in demand around the world. And eventually it has brought me down to far distant exotic New Zealand. I might have written on that war machine there from H.G. Wells' War of the Worlds. Here we have the man who's called the Lord High Minister of all that was sinister, the late Peter Lorre. 1951, the world was frightened by the thing from another world. And this is the thing. That is the thing from another world. Mr. Science Fiction is a writer of note and founder of Monsters of Filmland magazine. But it seems that your magazine influenced a lot of now famous writers. Yes, I would say the, uh, the most famous case would be Stephen King, who sent me a story when he was 14 years old. Should have got him when he was cheap, because nowadays he, he charges $10 million advance before he even writes word one on a story. I have a new magazine called Monster Ram, and in third issue, I'm finally going to publish that original 14-year-old story of Stephen King. But film relics like this Pteranodon from the original King Kong still fascinate. Or an alien from Close Encounters. Well, here, for example, is uh, part of a $35,000 suit. This is what is left of the poor creature from the Black Lagoon that was being swept up by a janitor, taken home to his kid, ran around scaring people, eventually wearied of it, sold it for $5 to the boy down the street. When I heard that, I said, hey, kid, like to double your investment? <laughs> he knew I was a... a oh, my God, what? Oh, uh, oh, there is the... The claw of the thing from another world. <laughs> Give me a bit of a scare there. Well, I tell you, I think uh, it's about time for my little child to go Betty by. I, I really wouldn't want him to stay up and be frightened by this episode of Home Show. <laughs> Mark Sainsbury with Forrest Ackerman. Those wonderful pictures from Leo Shelton. Now, Forrest Ackerman will be taking a piece of New Zealand film history back to his Hollywood museum. Peter Jackson, director of the movie Bad Taste, has given him one of the alien heads used in the film. At least they've got Rachel Hunter, so they know we don't all look like that. It's Holmes this week. Well, tell us who the convention is.